Good morning. Bright and early, waiting on the produce to show up. I need to drink my coffee. Today, I want to talk to you guys about daily specials and how we've been having a, a lot of success with them. Today, we are making, you guys know if you watched the last uh, watermelon video, it's that time of year we are running a big special on all watermelon juices. Uh, but we're switching it up today. We're making something different. We have pineapples on the way which are always a big hit people love pineapple even like pineapple videos are always a big hit uh, i don't know what it is about pineapple juice but people love it so we're gonna make a watermelon pineapple for this labor day um, market weekend we we're really busy yesterday all week we have been running just the watermelon lemon special if you guys want to see that recipe go check out um, how to make a basic watermelon juice it takes me all day to drink my coffee. I'm one of those people that like sips on it all day. And I should probably just like chug it and get it down. I'm gonna be juicing on Judy today. I'm gonna get her set up. Dad fixed our plumbing yesterday afternoon. Thank you, Dad. I'm gonna get set up, drink my coffee, wait for produce to show up. I'll show you guys the produce order when it gets here. So it's, it's just medium medium amount of produce. I can tell the, the fridges are empty. So satisfying like as a juicer when you like clean out the fridges and a new order of produce comes in. It's very satisfying. Daily specials are obviously different from your regular menu items. They're going to grab people's attention. People are going to feel like they need to come in and grab it. Um, one, because it's limited availability. It's not going to be around long, so they don't want to miss out on something. Two, we like to use like fun ingredients in daily specials, things that we don't normally juice, like pineapple, watermelon. Um, these are all opportunities that people feel like, oh, I like that, or that's different. Um, gives them a reason to come in. And three, oftentimes when they come in, they're grabbing all their other regular menu items, grabbing their regular order, they're grabbing a daily special, a lot of the time multiple daily specials because we do discount them. And we have a lot of success, like we'll do this on rainy days or slow days or times where it's just kind of, you know, the end of summer seemed kind of, people were just like winding down, uh, not really focused on their health yet. Um, which, and you can kind of see these trends like in your own personal life, like we're not thinking about cleansing or Whatnot. So offering something fun when times are slow gives people an opportunity to be like, hey, yeah, uh, I do need to go to the juicery and grab some juice and probably be healthy. Summer seems to be centered around like fun tasting juices, whereas winter is more like health and wellness. With that being said, people have buy been buying ginger shots like crazy. That's first up on my menu to juice. A bunch of ginger shots. Produce better show up quicker. I'm just going to keep talking and have a long video to edit. Produce is here. I see pineapples down there. It was an hour and 40 minutes late. So that's gonna put me a little behind. I'm gonna get this put up and juice, get some juice in the fridge. Friday's normally pretty busy for us, and then I will report back in when we get to the daily special. I'm also waiting on bottles, so I'll start with the ginger shots. What are we putting in this watermelon? Watermelon? Watermelon! Pineapple and beet. Maybe water. Do you think the beet will scare me? No, I think it'll make it really hard. The most amazing company in the whole entire world that I'm like, I'm we'll have some red worm. No, it's like a kid. I do not make my bed every morning, though. I'm going to try Then I'm trying to just get back in. It. No, I know. What I'm trying to do is make the upstairs in the oasis. I'll be a happy place. 
Are we doing one pineapple to melon? You guys make your bed in the morning? Leave your uh, answer down in the comments. I kind of just throw my blankets Or film me holding them. Nailed it? Yeah. Oh, I didn't press any buttons. It's recording, right? It's, yeah. And we are going to add a beat. This is actually shaping up to be a pretty good post workout or pre workout juice. These are full of electrolytes or nitrates, which bring a lot of oxygen, oxygen into the blood. I'm sure you guys have. Heard me give this spiel a million times. Watermelon is full of natural electrolytes and minerals. This watermelon will make around two gallons of juice. This pineapple will yield around 30 ounces. And this beet will give us, I think, eight ounces around there. If you want to see a specific of videos of how much juice is in one specific item, I do have a playlist. I'll link it down in the description. Let's get this cleaned up, cut up, and juice. Press bag's really full. I'm gonna let some of the liquid drain off, just like I do on the mini before we press it. Pressing watermelon can be, okay, it's okay, it's easy to press. It stays in the press bag. You just have to let it, what I do is I just let it drain out for a little while. Watermelon's so juicy, so. Get the bottles ready and we will check back in. Plumbers here. It's still screwed in right where it comes out. Tomorrow's a holiday weekend, so we're making a decent amount of juice. We're gonna make half with the beet pineapple and the other half watermelon lemon. Getting all cleaned up, we're just grabbing our juices for the market. Take them all out, yeah. Wanted to get a shot of the fridge all full. Should be a good day tomorrow. Thanks guys for watching. Definitely check out the channel if you're into juicing. We've got at-home juicing videos. We've got juicing videos here. Thank you guys for watching. Have a happy Labor Day 